Apologies for the delay. I've reviewed the matters raised earlier, specifically the point of Mrs. Metcalf contacting a witness. I'm sorry about that. I'm grateful for your apology. But unfortunately, Mrs. Metcalf, having established that you have contacted one witness, it raises the distinct possibility of you contacting other witnesses. I'm not going to do that. The prosecution have raised no issues over Mr. Radfield's bail conditions, but they have raised concerns over Mrs. Metcalf's, specifically tampering with evidence, accessing confidential contact details, and intimidating a witness. Mrs. Fisher also has concerns for her safety. Concerns that I share given the accused's readiness to employ underhand tactics and the history of Mrs. Metcalf's spouse's attack on Mr. Radfield. I'm sorry about all of that. Your apologies have been noted. But I'm afraid, Mrs. Metcalf, that to ensure that these proceedings are not prejudiced, I have no alternative but to revoke bail and place you on remand until the court date. And take it down. No, no. Prison. I don't want to go to prison. Please don't send me to prison. I'm so sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I messed up. I didn't want to hurt anybody. I don't want to go to prison. I just want to go home. Please let me go home. 